So yeah, I'm running around the Z1000. And uh, am I enjoying it? Yeah, yeah. It's got a lot of torque. Simple as that. It's just got a lot of torque. So when you when you turn when you twist this thing, man, you get pushed you get pushed back in your seat. Actually, what 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 what, what has happened to me multiple times with this bike is I twist the throttle and my butt slides back on the seat. But my jeans are kind of the the the, the 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 seat has good grip, so my jeans don't slide on the seat, but my butt does. So my butt literally slides back out of my jeans. You know what I mean? Which is kind of cool. You just give the throttle, moon the person behind you. And I'm, I'm not exaggerating. My ass, it, the, 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 the jeans come halfway off my ass when I twist the throttle. Not every time, but a lot of the time. I'm, I'm probably sitting a bit too far forward too. I should sit, there we go. I just shifted my butt further back. That's probably my problem. I'm sitting with my crotch up against the tank, and then when I give it gas, my butt slides back. You get it? My butt slides back, but the jeans don't slide, so I actually slide out of myself. There's gonna be police up ahead, I bet. <laughs> that guy waved to me, because you can see my hand moving around. I'm gonna go too quick. There's gonna be tons of. There's, there's always cops along this road. I got bus, I got a speeding ticket like a month and a half ago, and they always they're always right right around here. To be honest, I gotta I gotta really keep an eye on my speed limit. It's not easy, man. It's not it's not easy riding a powerful motorcycle and, and doing the speed limit. It's 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 it's, it's, it's a, it, a lot of effort is required, especially for me. I, mean, I, I, I'm, I guess there are other people that can do it, but I don't know how. <laughs> It, it blows my mind how slow people are in general, especially, well, in Taiwan, in Canada, not so much. I'm riding a, one of my scooters is a 50cc scooter. 50cc scooter, okay? That's, that's pretty much one of the slowest street legal vehicles on the planet Earth. And I still fly away from everybody when, at a traffic light when the light goes green. Light goes green, and I'm gone. And I'm looking back at my mirror, and people are like two blocks behind me. And it's, and it's like, it, I, I'm on the slowest possible street legal vehicle in the planet. And I'm pulling away from all the other vehicles at a rapid pace. And it's, uh Taiwanese, like, I don't even know how they could, how you can physically apply the throttle that slowly. Like, what are they doing? Are they just like, are they all driving like standards and they're putting it into gear and just letting the clutch out and letting it roll without giving any gas? I don't understand how they get to how they get it started that slowly. I couldn't do it if I tried. So this is pretty much my destination. I'm just coming. This is where all the bikers hang out, uh, or not all, but a lot of bikers hang out. So I'm just gonna come here, show off my bike. Mm, or, or the bike that I am riding that is not mine and then head out again Doing a race, race. My first race. And you qualified in second position. Got second. And this guy's got like a few dozen races okay. under his belt. He's, he's got more. He's, he's <laughs> good, man. All right, all right, all right. Hey, there's still a start to go, right? I haven't, I haven't practiced the start yet. 